approximately 200 clients monthly including sodomy we are attending to young boys especially and we have noted that the cases of sodomy are on the rise so we are yet to find out why all of a sudden there are so many young men being sodomized in our community as you go out to people let's try and aim to end sexual and gender-based violence, particularly against our women and girls, which currently is on, the, is on the rise with almost 30%, which means one in every three women having some sort of either sexual or gender-based violence, which takes, very, which takes various forms, including psychological torture, physical hurt, and even trauma. Even some cultural setups, it's assumed to be a normal thing that uh, you know, women can be abused, all women can be treated in a certain way to the level that some societies even treat women as children. I want to say that um, as, a, as a society, that's a Kenya obstetrician and gynecological society, we stand with the women and the men in this world, that the people can live in a, a world where they spouse and enjoy their rights to the fullest. Gender-based violence is one of the, you know, the serious uh, incarceration of uh, human beings and the flouting of uh, serious human rights for, in the world. On the cases of incest, where it is a parent who is a perpetrator, what uh, we are doing as empath is that we have a shelter where we are, we are putting in the children as we follow up the cases on their behalves uh, and especially based on the fact that it is apparent we get that most of these cases get compromised at the community level but uh, where, where the parents and the children office is involved then we are able to have the child rendered as a child in care, of, uh, care and protection we put them in, their shel in our shelter then once the case is, um, is finalized we link them up with the community, the relatives, or any other person who's willing up to take up the, the responsibility.